Hey Explorers, I'm Jessica. And I'm Robert. And today on Exploring the Local Life, we are talking about... Put your pants on. And other RV life lessons. Now, stay to the very end. We have a special Real Life Project announcement, so... Stay tuned. Seriously, we mean put your pants on. You're in an RV, and unless you have your curtains constantly drawn or window panes that are tinted and reflect everything off of it, everyone's gonna see inside your RV, okay? I mean, maybe if you're boondocking, no, but if you're in a campground RV park, and especially the ones that are really tightly packed in, guess what? You don't want everybody all up in your business. Unless you do. Yeah, now it could be you know, more of a communal situation and, uh, you know, whatevs, but no. No, it's just best to keep your pants on because when it's nighttime and your lights are on and you're inside your RV, uh, yeah, you have no privacy. Um, yeah, you can. it's like daytime inside your RV. Yeah, especially uh, with the curtains, if you have curtains like us, which are sheer. I, yeah. When we put them up, I immediately went outside with the lights on to see what it looked like inside. It looked like we had no curtains is what it looked like. Yeah, so it's like At the night. movie Rear Window. You know, if it's nighttime, the lights are on, keep your pants on. Or kilt. Or kilt. Much along the lines of keeping your pants on is keep your mouth shut. <laughs> yeah, um, most of these RVs have windows that are fairly thin, not double pane. And if it's a gorgeous day, you want to have your windows open, right? But once again, you find yourself next to your neighbors that may also have their windows open or might be outside. Now, if their kids scream louder than your kid, that's cool. <laughs> you're good, you're all set. However, yeah, you gotta keep your business quiet. If you are going to have an argument, expect that it will be public. Yeah, because that's the kind of life that we're living here. We Our never argue, though. Life, never, mm -mm. Mm -hmm. no, never. Never get upset at the kids, never uh -huh. have and a the kid kids upset. Never get yeah, no, no, not no, us. It's good. So, not you know, us. we never have to worry about that. <laughs> No, we we never. Great. We never say something and then go and immediately stare through our open front door or window <laughs> at our neighbors. Yeah. All right, folks, you got to make sure that your stabilizers yeah, are down yeah, yeah, and functioning because, again, discretion. We don't want everybody in the campground knowing your business. What is this? <laughs> or your kids asking too many questions. Another thing. Don't worry about your campsite. The best campsite is... The campsite that you are in. Why? Tell me about it. We don't want this whole, uh, the grass is greener on the other side situation to ruin your RV life, okay? Sure, that site with all the trees looks better, but you don't really know. Because in a storm, we're going to get a branch from that tree. That's right. So just enjoy the spot that you have. Make the most of it. Um, obviously, if you have a situation with neighbors or you know your electric box isn't working, that's that's something different. We're just talking about you getting into your spot, starting to set up, and frowning and being like, "Well, how come they've got fill in the blank?" So you're next to the dumper <laughs> or the laundry room. Guess what? You'll have a shorter walk. Bonus. You gotta see the silver lining here, folks, okay? Silver lining. Keep a positive attitude and you will have a fantastic RV life, okay? Yeah. Exactly. Next to the playground with all the screaming kids, guess what? Birth control. Oh my god. These are all good things, people. All good things. Yeah, so let's take a moment, sit back, relax, take a deep breath, smell the roses or the dump station. Look at the bright side of life. All right, folks, along the line of the whole grass that's greener on the other side, FOMO. That is the fear of missing out. It is a real thing, and especially so in an RV lifestyle. You're looking at people, or you're watching over there. They got a big old campfire going. They're having a party it's at a the other bonfire. side. And you're sitting here by yourself. <laughs> wondering why you weren't invited, or how come you didn't have your friends over. It's a real thing, but... Don't let it mess with your RV life, okay? Don't let it get you in a position where you're careening across the U.S. You can get to that event, spending all this money to get, you know, really cool chairs or, you know, your own little tabletop fire thing. <laughs> or 
fancy lights. <laughs> All those things are expensive. But you know what I'm saying. Don't let it get you into a position where you are no longer enjoying your RV life. Yeah, and if you think you're missing out, well, just have your own party. Get on Facebook, say, hey, we're going to be having drinks at 8 o'clock. And yeah. you know what? People are going to start coming down like snowflakes. That's right. Or just, you know, you see people having a good time, walk by and be like, hey, guys, what are y'all doing? We brought our own drinks. Can we join? Yeah. Most of the time, people are going to say yes. So, so don't have that fear of missing out. Don't let it mess with your RV living fun. That's right. All right, folks. Thanks for sticking around. And now it's time for the Road Life Project. Just hands. Welcome to Road Life's first annual Fall Festival event in Athens, Texas, October 14th through the 17th, 2019. They'll be trick-or-treating, so have your kids dress up and bring some candy. We'll have some, too. We'll have site decoration contests and kids' costume contests, movies on the lawn, pumpkin carving contests, and for you chasing adventure crowd, bring your courage because we're going to take an excursion to New York's Zipline Adventure where we're going to tackle nine ziplines head-on. And the fun doesn't stop there. Check out the sunken ships and airplane while snorkeling in a crystal clear pond. And if you didn't bring your courage, <laughs> we'll supply it with our wine crawl. We're super excited to see you at our first annual fall festival event. So go to roadlifeproject.com, click on events, and go ahead and sign up. And we'll see you there. All right, everyone. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to check us out on Patreon. And feel free to subscribe if you feel this video has earned your subscription. Hit the bell for notifications, otherwise you won't know when our videos come out. It's starting to rain. And don't unsubscribe by accident. That's right. That's a big rain drop. Questions or comments, leave them below. Oh. 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 Thanks, I like that when you say the obvious. Yeah, me too. I like it when it rocks. Can you do it again? <laughs> Later.